The new technology that we're really excited about and we've invested in is digital scan technology. It's going to make our work uh, faster, more transparent, easier to work with, more powerful. We've been running on an optical scan system, which at its time was state of the art, but it's 20 years old and it's old technology. You still have a paper ballot. It still gets scanned, but we're gonna take an image of the entire ballot and then read the marks in the target area later. There's some huge benefits to doing this, and it's why we chose Clear Ballot. So the new Clear Ballot system, it uh, captures a full digital image of the ballot, where in the past we had to run thousands, we, we might have to duplicate thousands of ballots. In this case, the only, the only thing we're really looking for the ballot is can it be scanned? It doesn't have any big tears, it doesn't have coffee stains on it. With the digital scan technology of Clear Ballot, we're going to be using a target area that's an oval. And everybody remembers that from middle school, from high school, scholastic testing. We think that the instructions are gonna be a lot more simple, a lot more intuitive, and people are gonna know what to do without thinking twice about what does connect the arrow mean. It's also easier. It's easier if you have shaky hands or if you have limited vision. You can see that oval. It's a lot easier than trying to draw a straight line. Instructions on how to correct your vote if you make a mistake, because sometimes people make mistakes. We're all human, right? Was to draw a line through your incorrect choice. Well, now, if you make a mistake, it's clear. Whereas before, you voted with a line and you corrected with a line. So our canvassing board would get together and go, well, we don't know what these people were trying to, to vote on. And our goal in Washington, we're a voter intent state. We wanna capture all that voter intent. So if you make a mistake, we don't want your vote to not count. And so this system will help with that too. Our ballot becomes a little bit more standardized in that it's eight and a half inches wide and then it can be anywhere from five inches to 22 inches long. Uh, with the uh, older system, you remember sometimes we had a two column ballot, sometimes we had a three column ballot, different widths. So it'll be a standard width, different lengths. Uh, it allows us to use, then use a standard envelope that will be coming out to you for each election. Adjudication in our older system would require a set of two paper ballots being remade um, and tracked and audited. It was very labor intensive. With a new system, and this will be done in teams of two, they'll be able to call that ballot up, look at the entirety of the ballot, and make a determination in their mind about whether that was a mark or a stray mark. When they do that, they'll be able to change it on the computer, keeping the original digital image always for reference, but then making it machine readable and more clear for the tabulation process. Who made those changes and determinations, who reviewed them and approved them are all part of the digital log so you know exactly what happened when and if necessary can be undone again. That's the kind of visibility and accountability that's really important for Pierce County elections and for voters. One thing I really liked about the system is what's known as vote visualization. It allows myself as an election administrator and other election workers to make sure every ballot is being counted correctly. Show me a threshold. Show me 100, show me 200. Show me the marks that counted as votes but were the least confident ones. Show me the marks that weren't counted as votes, but the least confident ones. And that is a ability that we've never had before. It's much, much, much more transparent than what we had before. Every election will have off-site voting centers open. With the clear ballot system, you can use a touch screen technology where you're just like your iPhone, um, you're touching the screen to mark your selections. You can uh, use audio headphones and make your selections uh, using uh, paddles and buttons. This new equipment is a marking device. It's an assistive pencil. It's for people who are blind or need large print or uh, just w w need some assistance in marking their ballot. No matter how you mark your ballot, whether it's with enhanced uh, font size on a screen or a sip and puff, at the end of your experience, you're going to have your ballot printed out for you, for you to inspect to make sure it's marked just the way you intended it to. And your ballot's gonna be processed just like everybody else's. Security and integrity are key for elections. If people don't have confidence in their elections, they don't have confidence in their government. And so it's important for us that the election is secure and transparent. Obviously, you come to our building, everything is visible. The system itself never touches the internet. After, after ballots are scanned, the ballots are moved to our ballot tabulation archive room, 
and they're kept there again in secure storage. We're still the same open and friendly election center that we've always been. We have a public viewing corridor. You can come in and watch anytime we're handling voted ballots in an election. But this digital technology does give extra visibility for the voters that may come visit us also. As we are adjudicating ballots, that is reviewing ballots, uh, doing our audits, our QC, we'll actually have screens in the viewing corridor where you can see what's on the operator's screen screen and look with us. Reducing the manipulation of the ballots, you increase integrity. Every time the ballot gets handled, you run the risk of a failure of integrity. And so as an observer, I don't want those ballots pawed over more than they need to be. Generating an image, storing the image, putting the ballot over here in safekeeping means more security. I have confidence that the results of the elections, of the tabulation, and the counts are genuine. The staff are very expert and professional in how they carry out their duties. It's going to cut down on so much time and so much effort in all those extra ballots that we had to buy to have. Can you imagine 50,000 extra ballots that you have on hand ready to duplicate? That's all going to go away. For voters, not a lot is going to change. We are still going to have that paper trail system that's so important for the integrity of the election. We're going to be mailing out ballots 18 days in advance. We're going to have the same election deadline. We're going to have the same ballot drop boxes and still the ability to mail in your ballot by a U.S. Postal Service. So all of those things are staying the same and the election law that we know and trust isn't changing either. With Clear Ballot, we're bringing one of the most transparent, accurate, and accountable election programs in the nation right here to Pierce County.